Well, right now I want to inaugurate a new feature on I've Got a Secret panel, and this, I hope, is one that will recur from time to time because it should be fun. It is called the I've Got a Secret Family Album. Over the months, people have sent us many interesting pictures, and tonight we're going to show you some of them. Now, the first one is from Mad Magazine. This picture was sent us by the publishers of Mad. It's from their current issue. May we see the first slide, please? Now, this is from a series that they do in which they say things we would like to see happen on television. This first picture shows a reasonably accurate picture of me speaking to a possible contestant and saying, so, Mr. X, if you'll whisper your secret to me, at the same time, we'll let the folks at home in on it. Now we show the next slide as to what Mad would like to see happen on the show. Next slide, please. <laughs> This is the sticker. All right. <laughs> now, this next slide shows a very interesting picture that someone was kind enough to send us. This is a picture of one of our panelists, and the picture appeared in Life magazine back in 1947. Keep in mind that it was 11 years ago, and the panelist was considerably younger then. Let's see the next slide and see if we can guess who it is. That's Henry Morgan, I bet must you. must be Henry. It's not me. It's not me. I never dressed like that in my life. <laughs> Gary, uh, I used to dress like that. <laughs> that is a picture of Henry Morgan taking at a very tender age, oh, obviously. <laughs> now, I have some more pictures, I and I would say. like you to try to guess who they are. But let me tell you something special about these special <laughs> pictures first. There is a new process of movie making called Cinemiracle. Uh, for which they use a special lens, a very special, special lens. In fact, there is a movie called Windjammer currently playing at the Roxy Theater, uh, which was shot with this special lens, which can do some pretty amazing things. The famous New York photographer Ouija took this lens, put it on his own personal camera, and made some very unusual pictures, which I would, which I would like to show you now. You must guess who they are. First picture, please. <laughs> What'd you say, Bill? That's you. How dare you? It looks like you. I mean, it doesn't. This is me after, all, after three days rehearsing for a jazz show. Actually, that is a distorted picture, somewhat distorted, of, of me. Yeah. Let's look at the next picture. Bill, how did you get that? That's me. How yeah. did you ever recognize I hate to admit it, but it still even looks like me. <laughs> looks like Dick Tracy. Let's quickly go to the next one. Oh. <laughs> I don't know who that is. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever seen you smile. <laughs> that, let's go to the next one. You look like a whale with a little eye. A very surprised looking Betsy Palmer. And then to the next one. Take me to your leader. That's exactly the name of it. Take me to your leader. <laughs> Well, we're going to collect such photographs as come our way, and from time to time, if you like it, and if the panel likes it, then I certainly enjoy it. I hope that we will have more editions of the Winston family, or the I've Got a Secret Family album. 